You see, this right here is the crown wheel. It interacts with the crown and stem to deliver motive power when you're actually turning the crown. It connects to the ratchet wheel over here, which is held in place by this, the click and click spring. It's connected in turn, the ratchet wheel, to the mainspring barrel just under it. And you can think of the mainspring barrel as a battery with its coiled spring re releasing potential energy into kinetic. It goes through a reduction gear train here, also called the going train. We got the first wheel, the center wheel, the third wheel and the escape right over there. Then you got the pallet fork and finally the balance, which you can think of as like a pendulum for a watch, right? It's the same function as a pendulum in a great big grandfather clock, just on a much smaller scale. And consequently, it has to beat much faster in order to maintain accurate timekeeping, otherwise known as isochronism.